It has been 17 months since the Tubbs fire devastated entire neighborhoods around Santa Rosa. Well, now the rebuilding has begun, and as John Ramos shows us, some fire victims are choosing a construction method that promises to get them home sooner. Building a house can be mentally exhausting with a thousand decisions to make and timelines to juggle. Now imagine doing that while you're also trying to rebuild your life. Came right over the top, right over that ridge, all the way into town. When George Nostrant lost his home in the Tubbs fire, he knew he wanted to rebuild. But there was one thing at the top of his wish list. Not spending three or four years of my life building. So George turned to a company called Hybrid Prefab Homes in Santa Rosa. They customize pre-designed floor plans, build them in modules in a factory, and deliver them to the site. George's new 3,000 square foot home arrived in four pieces with cabinets and fixtures already installed. Finish work is almost complete and he expects to be in the home in just a few months. If you know what you want, and light, or you know, know what you had, want to re replicate it, it makes it pretty easy. The company's managing partner says besides costing about 20% less than traditional construction, prefab houses offer something that appeals especially to traumatized fire victims, the chance to put the disaster behind them quickly and get on with life. Most of them are actually living on their properties. So every day they look outside and they see what's not there anymore and they're really, really wanting to get back to to it, you know, whatever that home may be. George says of the 100 homes that burned in his area, only 30 are being rebuilt. The rest of the victims have left. But he's staying because he doesn't want to give up what's just beyond his back porch. I wish I had more live trees around, but uh, the view is still great, so we're happy. The builder says, depending on design, prefab homes average about 8 to 14 months to build compared with two years in the traditional method. In Sonoma County, John Ramos, KPIX 5.